So when you compare American politics to Christian politics, where do, you, where do we start? Um, well, we start by Christians telling one another the truth and um, to sustain our lives um, in communities in which we know that death is always a possibility. Hmm. Uh, how um, baptism should shape the Christian community to be a people who know that death is real is um, absolutely one of the resources that makes Christians a polity that is quite distinctive from the general American polity. Mm -hmm. There's an anxiety that America will cease to be a Christian nation. I hope so. <laughs> I hope so. The, uh, the uh, idea that we are a Christian nation is an um, extraordinarily destructive one. How uh, so? Well, one, it, um, it assumes we know what we mean when we say democracy and Christianity and democracy are seen as wedded at the hip. Mm. And so that means that Christians in America can go kill other people in other parts of the world because they're not Democrats. And uh, I think uh, how we can um, convince Christians in America that just something very basic. We have, as Christians, we have a problem with war. I mean, um, uh, let's start there. Hmm. Just Christians have a problem with war. I mean, I'm a pacifist, but I'm ready to take just warriors on and say, you know, um, you think you, you, you've, you've got a problem with war. I mean, where did Christians get the idea that it was just okay to be in the armies? Hmm. And you point out, and this come, brings us a little bit back to love as well, but um, Christianity is a political religion. Uh, the ministry of Jesus right. can be considered as a, a politics of Jesus. Right. And furthermore, uh, Jesus wasn't accepted. Uh, if, if, if Christianity was all about love, you say, then why was Jesus rejected? Right, it's like um, um, before he got nailed to the cross, he should have said, I think there's been a failure in communication. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> how, how can you kill someone that's just saying we ought to love one another? Uh, the um, uh, Rome knew what it was doing. Mm -hmm. uh, and That it was subversive. That it was subversive. Because uh, render unto Caesar the things that are Caesar, and unto God the things that are God. Caesar wants it all. God has it all. And um, it is therefore, uh, Jesus is a politic, and it is a politic of the formation of a people who live by non-resistant love across time by establishing ways of surviving in a violent world by being nonviolent which is a very dangerous way to be. It but is. that's a politics. It is, yeah. And um, it is uh, one that I've tried to help us recover over the last 50 years. Mm -hmm.